the T-Mobile Rebel tablet. I'm going to show you how to perform a factory reset, okay? And this way you'll also be able to sell, but to sell it, but you're going to have to get rid of your Gmail address on here, okay? Anyway, let's go into factory reset. Let's go to settings first. Settings. And now from here, we're going to go ahead and scroll all the way down. Second to the bottom, it says system right there. Let's tap on system. Now you can go down to where it says reset options. And at the very bottom there, it says Era uh, erase all data, factory reset. So we'll tap erase all, factory reset right there. Now you can read this through here up here. Now more important is right here. You are currently signed in to the following accounts, okay? And it indicates one of my Gmail accounts that I signed into my email app on here, okay? Now the thing is, and on the very bottom here, it says re erase all data. If I tap on erase all data, it's gonna perform the factory reset. However, when I go back to set it back up, three quarters of the way to set up, it's gonna ask me um, either uh, what my password uh, what my password is to my uh, Gmail, my Gmail address and my password that's associated, that was synced to this tablet. So if you wanna sell this tablet, you should go back, delete your Gmail address, then come back here and then make sure nothing is under here no gmail address okay anyway i'm going to keep my email in email uh, email address in there i'm going to go ahead and uh, erase all data now and then for myself when i go ahead and set up again i will need to go ahead and um, input my gmail address as well as my password okay so now for me to confirm the factory reset i got to enter my pin password okay and here we go factory reset Tap on that right down there. Oh, erase all data, all your personal information, and download apps will be deleted. You can't undo this action, okay? So everything is going to be wiped out. All your personal videos, photos, or anything important, back it up before you do this. And it says right here, erase all data. Let's go ahead and proceed. Now we're just going to wait. Booting back up. And voila. There we go. Pretty simple. Questions or issues? Comment below.